Hello YouTube, it's the more 64 back with another video. Today I'm gonna be reviewing the Lion Cycles from Power Rangers Mega Force. And yeah, I actually looked up the name. I don't have any of the boxes with me. So yeah. Um But I do have the cards right down here. Oh, six of them. So yeah, let's take a look at those. Um, hold on, I'm just getting my phone ready. So yeah, sorry about that. Um, first let's take a look at this card, which is the Ultra Change Zord, not Hyper, but Ultra. And those fell. But for the sake of this review, and, and um, something else that bo kind of bothers me, I'm gonna call it the Hyper Change. My, well, header. So yeah, anyway, here's the Ultra, well, the Hyper, go say Great Megazord. It says Ultra down there, but I'm going to call it Hyper for the sake of this review. Um, and those two come with that bike. Next, we have the Knight Brothers Zord card. Um, so, yeah, there's that one. Here's the Gose gr Ground. It says Grand that down there, but I'm gonna call it Ground. Um, so, yeah. Megazord. And those fell. And those two. Those two. And that fell again. Those two cards came with this bike. Okay, why does this keep falling? I really need to get a flatter table. So yeah, anyway. Now here's this card, the Knight Brothers Zord card. Um. And it does come with the, well, it does look like the other Knight Brothers Zord card that we got. So, anyway, and here's this one. That goes a Grand Megazord. So, yeah. Now, I believe that's an accurate card, I think. So, yeah. I can't remember. Yeah, I think that one's accurate to the show. One thing is, I'm not quite sure if I did get these two cards in the correct placement or from the right set. So, yeah. Um. And there is another card that we will take with the Lion Mechazord when we get to that. So, yeah. And I'm not quite sure if that would be... Well, that came with it. So, yeah. Anyway, let's grab my Morpher here. And... I'm... I'm gonna see what these cards say. I'm only gonna do two because they all make the same sound. So yeah, anyway. Pencil! So yeah. I'm at some Zord. All the um, Zord. Well, the two Knight Brothers Zords. Well, say that as well. So, yeah, anyway. 
Tensile. So there's that card and the go say ground mech um cards. I'll say that as well. Now I'm gonna move these off to the side for right now. I'm gonna grab my phone and scan these. Okay, got that. And now that mag, well, the that Megazord cannot actually fly. So, yeah, like it did in that video. Those are just for fun. So, yeah. Anyway, and it crashed. I might. So, anyway, I'll scan this card. And that one fell. Okay, let's take this card and scan it. We got go say ground punching. And got that back. Scan this card. And there we have that. And it crashed again. So let's take this card and scan it. Got that. And it does the same video. So yeah. Anyway, gang rev this ad as soon as it loads. Anyway. And does that video as well. So, yeah, done with that, and I'm gonna crash on me again, which I kind of wanted. So, yeah, let's get rid of all these cards and get on with a review. So, yeah, now. And they fell. Now for all the figures, we just get this one, well, well, we get this some big figure that's in a, riding a bike, um, position, came stand, so yeah, um, only the arms move and the head moves, like so. Now these can't 
make out a full 360, but if you push hard enough, it will. Because this is soft plastic. So yeah. All these figures are basically the same. So I'm just going to throw those out. But one thing is they are better painted. These are actually white. The helmets are painted almost fully. So yeah. Anyway. Um, one thing is I will bring one of those back because I kind of <laughs> forgot that I needed them for something else. So yeah. Anyway. These are basically Zords on wheels. So yeah. Anyway. I'm taking these off. Holding these wings. And you get one of them. Um, we got Sky Leon. From. Well, from the. From Gose Knights thing. And Henar does come off. So, so, yeah. So, there's that sword. Next, we have C. Leon. Header comes off. And he does have wings, but that's not, like, accurate to the show at all. So, I'm just going to keep those out. And, well, and that's C. Leon. And... Here is the Hyper Change one. And here's this header. So, yeah. Now, this back part is not accurate, but this head is accurate. And also, this is supposed to be a head header, but there's no head. So, yeah. Anyway. Now... One thing is, these bikes, well, the bike part things, um, I'm just going to grab a random figure that is on the floor, because all these are basically the same. You can basically um, put this on like that, and like that, and do that. So, yeah, he could basically ride this other bike. And also, these do have kickstands, but they don't work on this table. So, yeah, uh, done that figure. And all of them could do that, so, yeah. And also, these are Zord boat ports. So, yeah, they are Zord that are capable. So, yeah. Anyway, um, that's basically it for these. Let's move these out of the way. We will bring them back when we, we review Groundion. Now, let's take this header, throw that away, and throw those out of the way. Let's get the other headers in here. Okay, here we have everything that we have reviewed thus far. Well, thus far, minus the two other bike zords. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, let's get these combined into Hypa Gose Great or Hyper Gose Great Megazord or Ultra Gose Great Megazord but I'm going to call it Hyper for the sake of this review. Anyway, take all these Zord headers off. Yeah, switch these two. 
just for the sake of remembering. I gotta take the head off. And yes, I'm gonna be staying up for this review. Um, well, for this part at least. Take all these headers off. And we're done. Well, actually, we do need to take these headers off of go say great so yeah we got this whole cluster of headers right here now you want to fold the wings up like that. Um, take this vehicle, take these off, flip this down like that, take these, clip them on like that, and it doesn't really matter for, oh wait, on. Got this wrong. Flip it like that. And it doesn't really matter which vehicle you use. They're all the same, but I'm going to use the red one so the colors don't cr clash. Put this on the back so you get more header ports. Oh, hold on. Actually, I'm going to take that off so that doesn't fall off. I'm going to take these cl clips right here, fold them up, and place these on there, like so. So yeah, place that on the back, like that. Now, we're going to be placing headers on here. Now I'm going to grab the card just so I have a reference of where headers go. So, yeah. Anyway, um, take the crow. Play, wait, hold on. I'm not quite sure if you can see that. Hold on. I'm getting the other box. Can you see that now? Yes, you can. So, yeah, um, anyway, take the crow, place it here. Now I'm going to do this accurate to the show. Take the hyper, I'm going to change header, place it right there. Take this header, on the terror header, place it right there. And take the hammer head, place it right here. Now, take the headers, well, the five main headers, place them like so, tiger right here, shark right there, um, dragon right there, snake right there, and phoenix right there. So, yeah, take the um, side, place it right there, take the cr crock, place it right there, take the taka, place it on that kneecap, take the um, manta, place it, well, fold these like that. And place it like there, well, right there, not like there. Anyway, um, take this header, place it on the arm, and place the um, saw shark, place it right there on the arm, 
And there we go. Um, but what are we gonna do with this piece? We gotta place it on the head. And, and this peg right here, right here, not this one, this one right here, I'm trying to point to it with you guys seeing it, right there, one right over my thumb. It's gonna go right on to this symbol on the head. So, like, so. So, here we have it. Um, Hypa Gosei Great Megazord. So, yeah. Um, now this is basically all the headers combined into one. Now, I'm not quite sure if this is technically the Ultra Zord. So, yeah. Mainly because it was shown early on and... Um, we haven't gotten the Big Mac, which is the... Um, um, hold on. I can't remember his name, but, well, it's name, but it was that big star ship thing. That, like, no one liked. Except me. So, yeah. Anyway, um. So, that's basically it. Now I'm gonna, I'm gonna get the bikes back here, and we will do the final thoughts. Okay, now for the final thoughts. Um, I think these are pretty good um, vehicles, well, Zords. Um, I do recommend them. Even if you do have the, well, mainly him, if you have the rest of the vehicles, and these two, if you have the, um, um Lion Mechazord, so, yeah, um, so, yeah. Now, I forgot to mention that these can become limbs for anything, like the Go Say Great Megazord, the Samurai Megazord, anything, anything Zord Builder related. But I'm not gonna show them because you get the gist. And you will see it in the Lion Megazord review that I will be reviewing next time. So, stay tuned for that. Um, so, yeah. I will leave a link for in the description down below to where you get all three of these. One thing is these are sold separately. I should mention that. So, yeah. Anyway, um, that's basically it. So, Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Later.